If you're on your iPhone home screen, you'll see that you can kind of go from left to right, and you can open folders, and your dock just stays where it is, basically. Um, if you want more ability to move around, like, say, scroll vertically, like that, or move your dock horizontally, which I can't show you yet, um, the easy way to do that is to install a couple of jailbreak apps through Cydia called InfiniDock and InfiniBoard. Now, I already have InfiniBoard installed, which is why I can scroll my home screen vertically, but I have not yet installed InfiniDock. So we're just going to search for that really quickly. And this is the same process as InfiniBoard, which I have installed. You can see the check mark there. So I'm going to click on InfiniDock, and then it's going to load the information page. And this one actually costs money. I didn't realize that. Um, so I'm going to purchase this one. Um, InfiniBoard is free. So if you're purchasing through Cydia, you have to connect with your Google account or your Facebook account. And I'm already authorized, so it remembers me. And I'm going to say go ahead and pay that 99 cents now. And the transaction's pending, and it's a success. And so I'm going to be taken back to the page. Now, that doesn't automatically download the app. So I have to remember to click Install here and confirm. And it's going to install. There we go. It's done. It's reloading data. And it's going to tell me that we need to restart Springboard after this. And Springboard's your home screen ap application. It's what displays the home screen. OK, there we go. Going to restart that at some point here. There we go. Um, so you'll see the jailbreak icon or the Apple icon, depending on how you jailbroke. And then you will see your home screen again in a second. There we go. Now, you'll notice I can move my dock around a little bit. Um, and as we talked about, you can move this around. So let's say I wanted to put my settings in the dock as well. Just holding down like I normally would to add it. And we can go like this. I'll scroll here. I don't want I don't want the uh, the settings to be right on the dock there. So now, when I'm on my home screen or my dock, I can just slide on over and I can get to settings very easily like that. And I can do the same thing with the dock by adding extra icons to the home page because I have InfiniBoard installed as well. So this gives you a lot more flexibility to keep everything on one page if you prefer it. If you like having multiple pages, that's cool too. Um, but this gives you more options and more flexibility and honestly it's a lot faster to just be able to scroll down and grab the app than it is to um, scroll over to another page and look in folders and so on. So, if that's what you want to do, do it. It's free for the uh, InfiniBoard and 99 cents for the dock. So, enjoy!